Everybody, uh, welcome back to the next episode of The Fishbowl. Uh, we're here today with a special guest. Uh, he's Prince's friend because uh, Prince is absent. All the time. Yes. <laughs> hey, what's up? How is everybody doing? Introduce yourself. Uh, my name's Vern. Um, yeah, I'm a friend of Prince's. Um, what, what do you want to say? Like, I don't know. What's your major, Brian? Um, uh, political science, Spanish major. I'm an Air Force ROTC freshman. Yeah. You know. Amazing. Amazing, yes. yeah. So, Vern, do you understand the format of our show? <clears throat> yeah, no, it's pretty simple. I, uh, you draw from. I've actually listened to you guys before. Oh yeah. Yeah, no, draw from the fishbowl and whatever it is you have to talk about. Yeah. It. What episode? Wait, what episode did you listen to? I forget off the top of my head. It was like back in October, though. Oh okay. It was a. Uh, I remember you were talking about tentacle porn. That's look at that. Mm, no. Um, Sao. Oh, wait, we always yeah. go back to anime. Yeah. <laughs> Every episode. It goes we no, no. Anime. It was. Oh, okay. So maybe that's a recurring thing. Yeah. We. Are also joined today by a guest who is not Caden, hundred percent, definitely not. Huh? What? It's it's your fucking voice. <laughs> I'm so confused. Oh, it's because he's doing an. Oh yeah. He's oh yeah. I'm, <laughs> uh, I'm Caden's cousin from Australia. <laughs> What's your name? God. Uh, Aiden. <laughs> Aiden. <laughs> Aiden. It's that's just Caden with without a C. <laughs> All right. No, I love doing accents. Give me an excuse and I'll. Okay, just talk in an accent the whole podcast. Uh, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Do like a really good on um, uh, Kendall's Homestuck <laughs> accent. I don't. There's a Homestuck accent. There's several Homestuck accents. <laughs> what the fuck? But like, I, I wouldn't know. I haven't started reading it. I yet. can't do any of them. Like, convincing. I finished part one of JoJo. Yes, you did. Mm-hmm. I still haven't finished part one. I got to the part where I'm. Um, I've spread knowledge. Yeah. Spread knowledge. Yes. Wait, wait, Vern. You know, you know what JoJo's bizarre adventure is? Sorry, I'm ignorant. Oh, okay, it's oh, fine. Oh, it's the single greatest show of on all time. <laughs> really? Well, I don't know. According to him. Yeah. Well, well I'm Kendall, only, you're not at the good part yet. <laughs> I'm only at the part where, um, uh, I don't know, I guess yeah. they, um, Come Jack the Ripper uh, is attacking them oh, in the tunnel. That's like mm. episode three. Like five or four. Three, three or three. four. Yeah. What's yeah. The, wait, what the hell is this show about? Uh, that's um, the, it's about everything. JoJo's Kooky Quest. All right. Uh, it's very listen. Listen to the previous to episode. We yeah. talked about this. We, we okay. talked. He, him and his friend Simon talked about it for like twenty minutes. Yeah, we don't need to. It was longer. <laughs> it was like forty minutes, brother. Yeah, for real. Okay. Yeah. All right. So I think we should start. With, all right. Wait, no. Wait, he's the guest. All, all right. <laughs> do I have the start. honors? Yes. Oh, yes. Always choose first. Right. Whoa, 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 whoa! You gotta do ASMR up to the mic. You know ASMRs? Yeah. Good. Right. You hear that? Yeah. All right. That's We're gonna good. be drawing our very first topic of the night. All right. Biggie versus Tupac, opinions. Hmm. Well, I I, I feel like you guys don't know Biggie or Tupac. I have no idea. What's For me, it's Tupac. Um, but then again, I don't I don't really have a very good discography of no very much of either. Do you know much of Biggie or Tupac? Listen, um, this is not my area of expertise. No. <laughs> I'd love to provide a comment, but I'm going to refrain. Um. Well, let me think. <sighs> I mean, I've listened to more Tupac than I've listened to Biggie, but if I had to choose, I would choose Tupac. In, I mean, like you guys aren't gonna understand anything I'm talking yeah. about. No. But um, he has a song. I mean, called, I know who they are. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, that's 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 about it. He has I a song. I don't. I forget his. They're both rappers. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I think my favorite Tupac song is called um, "Life Goes On," and he's like, he's like, "How many brothers fell victim to the street?" And it's really good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank is, you. Is that all we got? We're gonna go in a circle. Okay. I, no, I didn't know who was going. Oh, you're next. good, bro. You have to pass it to one of the people wearing a red flannel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a loud tapping noise. Yeah, I didn't tap it. I just straight up smacked it. She's just paddled it. She spanked that shit. I did. All right. Best type of cereal. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Reese like brand? bunches of oats. It just says honey bunches of oats. All right, in my opinion, you're wrong. <laughs> Whoa, no. But your opinion is wrong. All right, continue. There. I think you like fruity pebbles. No, oh. I mean I do, but that's that, that's not that doesn't take number one. Oh. Lumpy charm. <laughs> Lumpy. There's three choices. <laughs> three. They're all tied. Lucky charms. Lucky Boom. charm. Cinnamon toast crunch. If you say Wheaties, I'm gonna. I'm not gonna say Wheaties. I'm not gonna (laughs) say Wheaties. (laughs) Apple cinnamon Cheerios. The fuck? Do not (laughs) underestimate apple cinnamon Cheerios. What about? They're so fucking good. Honey nut Cheerios. That's good, but dude, apple cinnamon Cheerios are so good. What about Frankenberry? 
that's up there. I feel like it dropped in standings yeah, after the horrible did. cereal <laughs> incident that happened. Honey Munches of Oats. Honey Munches of Oats. Mm -hmm. It's over. Honey Munches of Oats is where it's at. Those little, those, okay, have you guys ever had Honey Munches of Oats? Yeah. 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 The, for the oat bits that you get sometimes, you just, and you're just like, and you just like, are so yummy and you die. I'd like to say you're all wrong. Pops is the best cereal. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. They're, it's good. Remember those pop I mean, commercials? I mean, I guess from your background. <laughs> Listen, I come from corn. I know how to appreciate corn much more than any of you city slickers Isn't do. Isn't the pops? City the, slickers? I'm from corn. Where are you yeah. from? Uh, it's a town called Milan. I'm sure you've never heard of it. It's like no. south of Sandusky. Mm -hmm. I just, I usually just tell people I live on top of Top Little Dragster. That makes more sense. <laughs> Fair enough. They've never heard of Near from. Cedar Point. Yeah. Ooh. Yep. Um, and that's right all Ohio on. has is roller coaster and corn yeah. and Columbus. Yeah. And Hicks. I just want to state very quickly. Corn includes Hicks. Reese's Puffs. Reese's Puffs Reese's are good. Reese's Puffs, Reese's Puffs. Puffs. I prefer. Beat them up, beat them up, beat them up. Beat em up. I prefer um, peanut butter Captain Crunch over Reese's really? Puffs. Really? I like, mm, I don't. I disagree. That might be because I just like I ate that more often. What about Crave? No. Crave's all right. At first, I thought it would be really gross, and then I tried it, and I'm like, okay, what, I fuck with it. What about Cookie Crisp? I do. Oh, like, oh Cookie. Whew. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I do like Gorilla Munch. Never heard of it. It was like because my parents only bought pretty much organic cereal. I hadn't eaten Lucky Charms until I came here. Um, that is, really, I'm sorry for you. But we ate That's from this one specific like line of cereals that all of like f like fifty something percent of the funds from it got donated to like conservation causes, and they had like Gorilla Munch, Koala Crisp, and some other ones, and they were all really good. Interesting. Cocoa Puffs are good too. <laughs> Cocoa Puffs are amazing. Never had Cocoa Puffs. I like Cocoa cinnamon Puffs. Frosted Flakes. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I, like I just frosted had the regular flakes. frosted flakes. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. You know, where's it? The pops commercials where they kill themselves. No, that's crave. That's crave. Wait, crave what? is the one where they're all eating each other. <laughs> oh no, shit! Cinnamon yeah, toast yeah, crunch. yeah, the cannibalism. But the cinnamon toast crunch. No, they and eat crave each other in crave. Yeah. Yeah, yeah they yeah. both do that. But, but weren't they suicidal in the pops commercials? Hold, hold on. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> Wait a minute. What? I, thought, I, thought I don't they, like, think so. I don't recall that. Pops don't have like sentience. They're just sphere. I know, but like that's the thing. Like in the commercials. Like they would just like they just fucking kill themselves. I thought. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. Kendall's researching this. I'm doing research. While they're talking, we um. Do we want to? Strawberries and cereal taste really good, in my opinion. Mm. No, that's true. Yeah, strawberries, yeah. Cheerios, and sugar. Yeah, a little bit of sugar. A little bit of sugar on top. That's good. good. Shit. Yeah. So what'd you find, Kendall? Uh, or bananas? I like putting bananas in cereal personally. Kendall, should I tell them the? Bananas and peanut butter. Frankenberry oh. massacre. Yes, <laughs> yes banana please, and peanut please butter. Please tell them the Frankenberry story. Fuck okay. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. So um, banana bread after work, dude. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> I saw Hell the, yeah. Bro, I saw the video for the first but time today. I've never seen it before. At work, dude. What it was like? So Hell the yeah. Fucking skunks. <laughs> Hell no, dude. I saw I the love video for the so first much. time today. No, it's not the pops commercial. It's so amazing. Really? What is it? Okay. Anyways. What were you saying? What were you going to say, Caden? Uh, the last time I thought I was going to die. <laughs> <laughs> um, I was hungry, right? Okay. Kendall witnessed this. I was, not, she wasn't there. but I was, I was she, uh, there in spirit. Yeah, I, I, we were talking over the phone. We were, like, texting each other. And um, so basically... <laughs> So it, well, what time was it? It was like two thirty. It was like a in the a.m. Yeah, it, it, I mean, it was it was early, late, late early. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, I said I wanted like gummy worms or something about. No, I yeah. said I wanted gummy worms, and then you said no. I want cereal. You said gummy sharks. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and then I was like, yo, I could fuck with some cereal right now. Mm -hmm. and you're like, go downstairs. I was like, well, I don't know if we have cereal, so I went and checked what kind of cereal we had. We had like life cinnamon. Uh, uh, we had a little bit of Lucky Charms, and then I saw it. We had some Frankenberry. <laughs> I don't even know what a Frankenberry no, no, is. No, it's like the Halloween. It's style. like Count Chocula. It's Count Chocula. That's good. Oh, Booberry. That's good. Booberry is okay. what I would use. Yeah. It's I like mean. brightly colored. Oh, okay. Good shit. So, I poured myself a big bowl of Frankenberry. Right, I started eating it. I'm like, <laughs> this is fucking delicious. <laughs> yep. So I finished that bowl. <laughs> I poured myself another bowl. <laughs> the cycle repeated until I finished my sixth bowl. Oh my god! And by then I had finished 
uh, three quarters of a gallon of milk. <laughs> <laughs> How many um, calories is that? I don't. The, that's not what I was worried. <laughs> a few. About. I know, but just a um, few. Just a few. <laughs> what were my symptoms? Uh, stomach hurt. You just said you didn't thought my head you were, hurt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I had a, like a really bad. You thought you were going milk. to die. Yeah, I had. Milk. Like, I couldn't move. I mean, I I went like I struggled to go back upstairs. It was to my like bed. the alien. It's like, like the alien Fuck. from the movie. Dude, I bet your stomach was gonna... rock solid. I'll bet if you went and padded that shit, you would have vomited all. The oh, easily. Out. Like I mean, if I made any sudden movements, I was gonna blow. <laughs> <laughs> that was. Uh, when was yeah. this? This was. Like, a while. Veterans Day. Hold on, oh, okay. I can probably trace it back because I okay. know at least one quote from that conversation is saved. Yeah. I, you know, this makes me want cereal. I haven't had a bowl of cereal. Oh, that was like when we discovered months. cereal, Nancy. No. <laughs> what the fuck, cereal, Nancy? No. I feel like we've talked about this. But. Cereal, no. Nancy, was. Uh, <laughs> how did that conversation well, become? Here's what happened. So I said, "It's like you're gonna get a cereal monster coming out of your chest." Like in the movie Alien, Alien. Alien. yeah, and so <laughs> the and, then, babies. and then I followed it up with the statement something along of cereal monster wet with organ juice, and Caden <laughs> said that sounds like the title of something you'd find on Pornhub. Yeah, no, and exactly. I went, yeah, okay. Oh, no, I don't know where this is going. Then no. I told her to look it up. <laughs> and so I did. Oh. Cereal Nancy, and cereal, cereal Nancy, Nancy came up. up. I'm looking it up. No, no, don't. I don't know if we should do oh, that. Oh, got to get off the school Wi-Fi. I oh. <laughs> personally have not seen any images of Serial Nancy. I did not look. I saw the title and I panicked. Let's look at images. I don't know if you're going to find any It images. was a very, very, like, it was the only search option that came up. I, I'm, wait, did you go to, did you go to Pornhub? Anywho. So this is a great time to segue into a new topic. Yeah, yeah, we were, we, yeah before we keep talking about porn, we were from serial porn, <laughs> as most things in life do. Honestly, yes. it wasn't like a gradual change. I mean, it was like <laughs> yeah, yeah, straight yeah. up. No, because that's the that's the. Uh, it was at one thirty in the morning. Yeah. Um, and that's that's the quote that saved is serial Nancy works a monster cock through a glory hole. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. There are actually two quotes saved from that night. That and now there's no brain cells left to get you to the ER. That's a little bit tries of a to beat burst out of your chest right alien there. style. <laughs> okay. We're rapidly increasing the tempo. Climax. <laughs> no, there's three. You just fisted that ball. <laughs> there's three because there Cereal was this Nancy. very long one that I sent about the bedtime. Oh, yeah. How about the LAN party? Yeah. Shh. What tramp stamp would you get? I wouldn't. <laughs> yeah. No. no. Okay, let's. But see. if I had to get one, yes. live, laugh, love. <laughs> <laughs> JoJo star tattoo. No, no, no. that's going JoJo on my right shoulder. JoJo tramp stamp. <laughs> JoJo tramp stamp. JoJo tramp stamp. Oh yeah, I I know what I would get. What? What? So there's a character in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure oh, named God. Uh, Gyro Zapelli. He has a belt buckle, which is three hands with their index fingers sticking out, pointing down. <laughs> Pointing down to like his dick. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> let, me, let me find it. How, ba- how about you get something like straight up, like I don't know, like the Bill of Rights. The Bill of Rights. <laughs> the whole thing. The, the whole thing. Just the whole, the whole fucking Bill, Bill of Rights. Rights. So when your homie going, so when your homie clapping them cheeks, he can learn a little bit about the Constitution. <laughs> Hell yeah. Make it. It has to be education. Yeah. yeah. 100%. Beat me to it. Oh, it's two. It's two hands. Oh, it's two hands. Love, yeah. laugh, love. Right there. Semen. Semen? Just have semen. Semen? Just the like, word semen? Just the word semen. An American typewriter font? I want Fortnite in Comic Sans. Corey my new. Tramp stamp. <laughs> God, I fucking hate that the so hell? much. <laughs> Comic Sans. Wait, what? <laughs> Ooh. Belt buckle? That's the belt buckle. I have a it's belt a buckle that's got that's like a, a pirate, like skull and crossbones with a like ship wheel in the background that spins. I don't know where I got it. <laughs> I don't know why I have it. It spins. Yeah. So you can go like. I have, yeah. you know, I I have a uh, Mercedes and a Toyota hood ornament <laughs> that I want Stick to put it on. on your forehead like a unicorn. I want to put it on a belt buckle. Fair enough. You know, I I've uh, I'm changing it again. I think I'd probably have Goofy as my tramp stamp. Like it'd just be his face. <laughs> Like Goofy from the Careful. Mouse. I like that. That's copyright infringement. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen the thing they've started to do on Twitter where yeah. they go like... I want this on a shirt. I want this on a shirt. 
This shirt is not copyrighted. Yeah. It's from Disney. We are stealing it. This site steals art. Please sue <laughs> us. <laughs> sue us, Daddy Disney. <laughs> <laughs> I never, I'm never on Tinder. I'm also Tinder. Tinder. <laughs> You're always on Tinder, bro. Oh no, no. I'm, well, yes. <laughs> it, it, it depends. It depends on the day. All like right. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I'm never on Twitter. That's what I was gonna say. Yeah. I but hate, he's always on Tinder. No, I hate going on Twitter. I, I like hate Twitter. going on Twitter, and I hate going on I, I, Tinder. Unless it's for memes, that's about it. I like Twitter until I have too much exposure to any Twitter and to humans. And uh, K-pop Twitter. <laughs> oh, wait, I never said what, what tramp stuff I'm gonna get. I don't know. <laughs> I think I'm gonna get a um. Uh, the Ten Commandments. A, <laughs> uh, a ten tattoo of oh. Corinne's face. Tattoo of Corinne's face. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, valid. You should get uh, thou shall uh, thou shall not commit adultery. <laughs> thou shall not <laughs> fuck. Pointed at my ass, correct? <laughs> <laughs> thou shalt fuck. <laughs> this is a little outdated. What? Uh oh. Slutty Halloween costumes. Oh wow, that's a little. Slutty creeper. Slutty, yeah. creeper. slutty creeper. Slutty creeper. Slutty Minecraft creeper. Kendall one is a slutty Minecraft creeper. Yeah. I did. Okay, so I saw some uh, like on Instagram during you know Halloween season. I saw some um, like Halloween outfits, and it was just straight up like stripper outfits. Mm -hmm. yep. Yeah. Like it was nothing. I was like. You're just dressing like a thought. <laughs> like, if if like you're going out Halloween. as a thought for Halloween. Yeah, for yeah. real. If, like, no, sorry, you go first, Michael. Like, I don't understand how some some people like how people survive out here, like wearing no clothes. Right. Like, like even right now, like it's I was walk, I could probably walk down Court Street right now and see like a bunch of like dudes with like their tops unbuttoned and like girls wearing like short dresses just like walking around it's the like 30 we go to yeah it's to like be 38 sexy. degrees out yeah i know i don't <laughs> to be get it fair either. though if you're a lady and you try to go costume shopping you can't buy anything from a store because it's all like Skimpy. sexy nurse yeah. uh like, unless that's what you're going for <laughs> yeah like if that's what you're deliberately going for yeah but more power to you there's but... a reason though that you can only buy that <laughs> why well, I mean, that's just what people. That's yeah. What people well, I mean. oh, yeah, well yeah. no. How society that's, is. That's a society it's, it's and consumerism really for you like, right there. <laughs> maybe not the consumers, because every time I go to Spirit, hands down, men's costumes are sold, women's costumes are not. It's just they're trying to sell to an audience that isn't there. Then they should yeah. sell to Ow! the audience that is Fuck. there. I broke my nose. Exactly. Or just, or just use Amazon. Unfortunate. Oh, I, I do. I do like whoever one is uh, as Alexa for Halloween. Look, I broke it. <laughs> for Halloween. I was gonna dress up as a burger, but I didn't. Oh, that's good. my best friend went on a Rubik's cube as a Rubik's cube once. <laughs> Whoa! Wait, did you get like? Did you make it himself? I don't know. I like that. Kanan, did you make it yourself? Are you trying to answer? communicate with yeah, him was, telepathically? Yeah, <laughs> my telepathy is uh, my game's off today. You know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, mob. I can't think about um. Uh, is that a Homestuck reference? No, it's a Mob Psycho reference. <laughs> oh, haven't seen it so. Think of, I can't think about s slutty costumes. Um, cause I mean, I don't really know if I saw any on Halloween. I feel like I did. Everyone was dressed as Joker though on Halloween. Mm. Yeah. I mean, I wasn't really paying attention. You weren't. <laughs> what? What? That's one way to put it. Yeah. Also, <laughs> I was absolutely blasted. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very interesting way to get put. Yeah. I was not coherent. Yeah. I was fine. For a while there, for a while. I w listen. I could walk. <laughs> I was fine. Like I could, I could, I could walk and talk. Wait, where was this at again? Here. Halloween. Yeah, no. I mean, like, where? Where were you at? Like everywhere. I don't know. <laughs> All over. You know? Yeah. Yeah. We tried to go to a party, but it was busted when we got there. So we went back and we drank more. <laughs> See, unfortunately, with uh, like the uh, me being in ROTC, right? I have to, you know, I have to be smart. Like, mm -hmm. I can't just. Have fun like everyone else mm -hmm. all the time. It's I mean, you can have fun without drinking. Yeah, no, exactly. That's what that's usually what I do. Just you know, go yeah. sightseeing and watch everyone else be an idiot. <laughs> Culture walks. That's what I do. That's great. I, yeah, although it's so cultured. I don't know. It makes me uncomfortable though, and when I'm sober and everyone else is drunk. Oh yes. No, yeah. that's true. That's why you go with like a sober safe. friend. Go go with some like friends that aren't gonna get. Yeah. I would rather be the only sober person than be the only drunk person. Oh yeah, easily. What? Someone was waving. Oh. And now they're running away. Why didn't they knock on the door? That was cre that was crazy. Crazy. <laughs> that was crazy. Like, crazy. We should probably move on to something else. Um unless we have more uh, slutty outfits. Uh, no, I don't. I mean, <laughs> I, don't I was going to go as an angry bird. That's pretty hot. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Damn. 
Damn. The triangle bird. See a nice tail you got there. <laughs> uh, I already picked, bro. Oh. It's your turn. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Before we pick, we should look at Flick Chat. There's no... I doubt there's anything. Yeah, there is no one, one said thing. anything, something. brother. Uh, Prince's friend said something. Oh. Um, or whoever... Who, Aiden V. Oh, that's my friend. Oh, that's your friend. That's my boy. All right, there are th he he uh, put in three. Uh, okay, so how each of you met the other hosts? Well, Prince isn't here, but we can still talk about how we met yeah. Vern. Mm -hmm. So I, I guess we can. We're all gonna have three different stories, I guess. Well, I mean, Vern's not a host; he's a guest. <laughs> well, I mean, we can say how we met him. That's true. Wizard yeah. one hundred and one. <laughs> yeah. That, that's what? how we I met mean, yeah. Wizard 101. <laughs> I'm so confused. Yeah, no, I, I was online on Wizard 101 and we became friends uh, before we went to college. That's actually not true. He's making this shit <laughs> I up. Was, <laughs> no, I, I was with Prince, right? And we, yeah. were, we were over in that. Uh, was, was Gam's Kitchen. We were in the Gam's Kitchen. kitchen. And uh, they were both playing Wizard 101. And I was like, oh, shit, I haven't thought mm -hmm. of that in 10 years. And so I downloaded it. And yeah, it was a pretty good time. That was mm -hmm. good. Um, I met Caden. Uh, How did we meet? I like we talked. That's about like this. a gray space. We talked about this at uh, dinner, or breakfast the other morning. At, before, we, well, maybe before we went to media, we talked about it. We met. Um, remember at the beginning of the semester when we all went to um, meet. With our oh, that's community? right. And Olivia never showed up. Yeah, and then Olivia never showed up. <laughs> that's right. And then we met each other. And then I yeah. think we went back to game. We just hung for a second. Then went to go. Oh to yeah, because you guys helped me bring my chair. Yeah. You and Grace. Mm -hmm. That's right. That was the first day Caden I met. Mm -hmm. I met Kendall when Caden asked me a few days later. He's like, bro, let's make a podcast. <laughs> so I was like, That's what Caden okay. sounds like, everybody. <laughs> well, I had to differentiate. And uh, I never met Kendall before. Mm -hmm. And I was like, what's up, Kendall? And, uh, and that's Kendall's Anna. the single most intimidating person ever. I'm not. You are. You absolutely no, are. I'm Kendall, not. I thought you hated me the first time we recorded. I'm record, sorry. I'm just kind of like that. <laughs> it's okay, though. You're, I don't think. You really think. I mean, I don't know you that well, but I don't get an intimidating vibe. I mean, you were playing Wizard 101 when I met you. Yeah. <laughs> I, for some reason, Caden was super scared of me. Listen, I don't know why. I wasn't scared. You just you were intimidating. I'm so I met Kendall <laughs> two weeks before the semester started. We went on a canoe trip together. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. And she was one of the people that stood out, maybe because of the purple hair. I don't know. Yeah, my hair was <laughs> purple then. Yeah. Um, I was like, fuck, she's going to be hard to talk to. <laughs> Um, but in reality, <laughs> she was one of the nicer people there, yeah. and we got along quite well. Yay! Yes. Until I started trying to unfold and refold the map. Yeah, <laughs> on a, a I'm windy still day. salty about that. <laughs> we were in heavy wind in a canoe, and Kate was in charge of steering, and I'm in charge of power because I'm in the front of canoe. I was we being were, efficient. We were the navigators for the day, and we're getting blown into weeds. And Kane's like, hold on. I got to unfold and refold the map so that we're on the section of land that we're in. I'm like, all right, cool. But the wind's super heavy, and we're getting blown into the reeds, and I can't do this by myself. And then he's out there like. I was being map. efficient. <laughs> we fell behind the entire group. It's fine. No. I was being efficient. <laughs> it might be my band posture. I stand very straight. Yeah, I think that's part of it. Yeah. Then again, I'm still like a foot tall. <laughs> are you in yeah. the wait, are you in the band? Not here? in the band here, but I've yeah. been in marching band in high school. Yeah, that was me. Life. What'd you play? Clarinet. Okay. What'd you play? Uh, trumpet. Oh. Oh come on. <laughs> Whoa. I played the saxophone I didn't judge fifth you. grade. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I know clarinets are ass. <laughs> I accept this. I mean it's I like clarinet more than flute. I'll give it that. Mm -hmm. I'm from the Stoner group in band. Wow. Percussionists? Yeah, and the drum line. <laughs> I think for just kind of, I mean, like, at least my freshman year, that was the stigma of the seniors. They were definitely stoners. Our percussionists were fine. They were just, they were the, they were meme lords. Sousaphones are crazy. No, uh, back where I was from, uh, percussion section, crackheads, all of them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Good crackhead. For the yeah. Most part. There were a lot of crackheads in my high school. Oh, like actual crackheads or? Uh, <laughs> well. Was there crackheads? Well, involved? actually. Oh. Oh, oh shit. There were there were a couple of people that stood out. And yeah. They they definitely did crack, like oh <laughs> confirmed. Not not just. I'm not inferring. Like like, <laughs> they told me. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Caden. I do crack. Hey, bro, you want? Kind of what crack. happened. Oh, you want the drugs? <laughs> like yeah. Noise. Drugs, not hugs, everybody. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And now, I'm here. And the person two doors down from me smokes copious amounts of weed. Oh, but that smells great. It doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't. It smells awful. You're probably yeah. used to it at this point. 
I mean, not really. We don't really get used <laughs> nope. to it. Same thing kind of in uh, uh, Scott sometimes. Yeah. There's, there's, um, I'm not really in that hallway, the hallway that is. Uh, it used Gina's. to be. There were there was a group of people for a while there that would smoke weed in the early morning in the lounge, and then it would make the entire hall smell like it was so bad. Interesting. I'm in the honors dorm, and it still smells like weed. Mm. So. It smells like honors weed fucking everywhere. I mean, like this whole fucking, fucking campus yeah. smells like weed. weed. Like, I was unsure of who it was in my hallway that did it. I knew it was someone very close to me. But then it was like two days ago. Two days I was walking ago. in the hallway back to my dorm, and the guy two doors down from me opened the door, <laughs> and it just hit me so fucking hard. I'm like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> it was disgusting. Oh, my God. That's, that's mm, fun. Yeah, Very not fun. fun. Very fun. What, a, what other? Do we have anything else in there? Um, oh, yeah, how we met yeah. people's. Yeah. Okay, and I met Vern when I was at... Uh, Jeff Market buying condoms. Oh, oh right. shit! You were buying condoms. Oh wait a minute! No, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you were with my friends. Yeah. Um, yeah. With Mia, Carla. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 All of them. <laughs> Don't laugh. Yeah, those... Listen, you got a bag before you tag it. Yeah, no, I appreciate that. But I that. haven't had the opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was more the idea of I don't think you. Hey, you know, it's like it's like a you know, you'd rather have a gun and not need it than need a gun and not have it. I suppose. Um, you never know. You, you never know what can happen. Yeah. Anyways, uh, wait. Mm. Wait. Did we did? Wait. I guess. I met Vern, um, at Shively. Hell yeah. Yeah. Mhm. I don't remember the the context. Nope. But. <laughs> but that's where we I met. Remember, yeah. You you sat at our table and we got along. Well, that's the important part. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I know you were in. Well, I knew you. I knew He's you in were in Bio too. Yeah. Yeah. You're in P Bio. Everyone's in P bio, I swear. I'm yeah. not. You're lucky. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna have to take like advanced P bio classes for my major though. So like dendrology and stuff. I don't even know what that means. Trees. Whoa. Tree like study. Trees. You like trees, bro? I do like trees. My Pretty uncle dope. is a tree expert. A dendrologist. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. One would assume. Um, so I say we uh slap that fishbowl fern. It's you ready? Turn. It's Kendall's yeah. turn. All right. I, I know. know because no? well, I never got to go. They, oh, yeah, because we did the flick chat. Yeah. Oh, that's right. All right. <clears throat> what <are you> doing? <laughs> All right. Uh, fan camp. Ooh. Now, there's a lot. There's a lot there. I don't know. Did you? Did I? You did band? Yeah. I oh did yeah. Band camp. I feel like. Have, uh, have we talked about band, band camp before? Or have we not talked about band? No. Shit. I have a lot of band camp stories. Uh, yeah. So this one time at band camp. Um, I uh it was a senior year, right? Yeah. Uh, we it was like starting to rain outside and the place where everybody practiced it was an inside place with huge windows mm-hmm. uh behind the band, the band director, right? So, uh and so all the seniors uh, we were like we had to go out for something. And so we decided uh that since it was raining out, all the senior guys decided that'd be a great idea to shower outside in the rain and like behind the band director so we all go out with like our soap and we're all like in our swimming trunks and we just start showering while everyone else is playing <laughs> while everyone else is playing inside the room it was the, she the lady turns around and she looks at us and she's like y'all are out of your mind she's like you better get back inside like she was acting <laughs> like a mom or something it was great um yeah I, I, there's so many stories from band camp though mm-hmm. I love band camp. We had, I always made it tradition that whoever sat at my table for lunch during band camp, because we would like go outside in the early morning and then it would get like, during the hottest part of the day, we'd have lunch and sectionals and then go back out. But I would read my immortal during all of band camp out loud to everyone eating lunch with me. So I didn't eat that much. I was mostly just reading my immortal out loud to everyone. If you're not familiar with my immortal, just, just Google it. Fair enough. I wasn't until I met Kendall. Yeah. <laughs> What's that's it my, about? It, oh no! It is uh, a, no, just quick, quick, quick. My Immortal is a <laughs> Harry Potter fan fiction, oh. uh, written like early 2010s. Uh, All right, so who's fucking in it? And to give you an idea of what it's about, uh, it's still debated to this day whether it is satire or legitimate because it's so bad. <laughs> Interesting. It's where they all turn gothic, and uh, that's the plot. It's gotta be They're all vampires that's and goths. That's the plot. That's the plot. That's the plot. Oh, wow. Uh, anyway, so we do that at band camp, but we also had these, like, 
we would have uh we have a bead competition every year where if you do something like uh that you didn't have to do like going above and beyond you get a bead and whichever bead has the most whichever section has the most beads per person in the section at the end of band camp get to go to dave and busters with the band director and stuff uh the majorettes won last year the trumpets have won every year before that because there's a lot of them and because one of the like helping college students that come back and help is a trumpet and a trumpet will be like standing at attention like they're supposed to and she'll be like yay three re- three beads so, but i'm not salty about that it's always hard for clarinets to win because we're the biggest section um anyway point being bead competition these beads <coughs> are like plastic you know the ones that you make little like necklaces out of when yeah. you're a kid sousaphones never have any beads at the end oh you want to know why why because they suck because they eat them what that's a tuba thing yeah they just eat they stuff. just eat <laughs> fucking everything <laughs> yeah no eat everything yeah they'd always be like yeah we we got we had you know 32 beads at the beginning of the week and our band director would be like where are they and they would be like you know where they are what justin the, what the heck? <laughs> that's kind of fucked actually that's just weird saying. what the hell are they suzaphones have also eaten a clorox wipe deodorant stick uh <laughs> probably some other stuff i don't know i think the only i should have been a sousaphone i think you'd fit in well <laughs> would you yeah. would you eat deodorant depends on how much money is <laughs> in it for me what i've eaten a what lot flavor of, of deodorant <laughs> no it was like the uh like the dove like cool minty breeze that shit's so good Ooh, oh it's mint God. flavored i like it no it's not <laughs> mint flavored <laughs> i use Mints. right guard would you eat it probably not i eat right <laughs> on the daily yeah yeah i ate a bowl of nails for breakfast Ooh, without I mean, any milk <laughs> i eat bugs kendall yeah. has eaten uh, despicable wait despicable things despicable despicable me i feel like that's not the word i was looking for <laughs> despisable no Weird. disgusting i think despicable yeah, was the word i've eaten a lot of things that i probably should not have in retrospect yeah this Hindsight is 2020, I guess. <laughs> that's not gonna. That's not gonna stop me from doing it again. No. You were about to eat. You were about to eat ice cream off like the street on the yeah, way here. I was gonna do it. She was. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, you all went to dinner together? Um, mm. sort of. We just I mean. kind of like showed up. We ran into. Yeah. Him. Nobody was there. Oh, we yeah. were. It was like Boyd. Oh, it was Boyd. only a few of us. Mm-hmm. That's fun. Yeah. yeah. Um. So my van camp. Mm-hmm. Have I not? I'm pretty sure I talked about this on episode five. But no one, else, you guys, no one was here. It was my friend Henry, Luke, and Connor. Mm-hmm. Um, I listened to it. So, so maybe you do remember us talking about band camp. Vaguely. All right. So last year, personally, senior year for me, it was the greatest band camp I ever had. Everyone else, not so much. <laughs> so, specifically stated in the rules, obviously, no illicit substances are allowed at band camp. No uh... vapes. No jewels, no weed, all right? And obviously, no one gives a shit. <laughs> so they bring it anyways. Um, not me, because I'm a good... Good little, noodle. Little, good, I'm a good, I'm a good, good Christian noodle. boy. I'm a good Christian boy. And um, so we're just chilling there. So, okay, so band camp's from Sunday to Friday. Sunday. We're having a great time. The day of the Lord. The day of the Lord. We get there. The Sabbath. We're, yeah, we're, we're having an amazing time. Monday, wake up. Just do some drill in the morning, go get lunch, sectionals, more drill, free time, having a great time. And uh, we had to dance that night, Tuesday. Um, wait, was your guys' camp like, where was your guys' camp? It was at the school. Oh, yours was at the school? Yeah, Mine? we would just drill, well, because we didn't have a practice field, so we just practiced in the parking lot, and they painted lines on the parking lot on, oh. like, half of it, and we'd practice on the hot asphalt, and sometimes it would melt the bottom of your shoes. Interesting. Ooh. Mine was like an hour and a half away, and it was at uh, Bluffton University. Oh, an actual university? Yeah, and let me tell you what, Bluffton University, it's hell on earth. That place sucks. Really? Bum fuck Egypt, right? Just like <laughs> everywhere else in Ohio. Yeah. And it's uh, the practice field that we'd go to was like in a low point in like a, a valley, and this is like the middle of July. Hey, at least you it's had like, a practice field. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess. <laughs> but like yours was at your high school. You got to go home to air conditioning. Oh, no. Don't be mistaken. No, I mean, like, you got to go home every day, right? Or oh. did you stay there? Did yeah, you... no, we got to go home, but the air conditioning in the school was broken. Okay. Oh, you boy. still got to go home. Oh, you did You had <laughs> to, like, stay we, in the... It's an hour and a half That's away. Like, we had... Out? No, it was a university, and we were at, in their dorms, 
but they didn't have air conditioning in their dorms. That's oh, rip. Terrible. Yeah, maybe so one sorry. fucking vomit. Well, you went to university. I went. You went to school. I went to an actual just camp in the middle of the woods. <laughs> that sounds like so much fun. It was though. a ton of fun. Like you could like you can like kayak in the lake. You go fishing if you wanted to. It's like during free time. But um, at least and the cabins were air conditioned, so that was good. I know. Well, more Where jealous. was it at? It's called Camp Muskingum, oh, Northeast okay. Ohio. It sounds like a place that my brother's been for Boy Scouts. Maybe he might, have, or maybe he's thinking of a uh, camp. Um, Wait, where are you from? Akron. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, then yeah. Probably. It's a little bit south of Akron. You know where Carrollton is? Nope. Never mind. Then that's where I think that's where it is. But um, Tuesday, hey, we're all having a great time. Then the, there's then the, the, there's a talent show that night. But a little bit before the talent show, someone snitched on someone else for having a jewel. So then they go um, uh, punish this girl. They take her jewel away, and um, she was gonna have an ISS when she got when school started because this was like early August, and um, this enticed the uh, camp counselors and like the directors to search everybody, all the which is fair. They searched they searched all their bags, just went in, just went into their bags and like I'm pretty sure five people got ISSs. Two people got kicked out of camp and arrested for having weed. And it was a very depressing night for so everybody. So who is this asshole who decided to rat out the, the chick? Who's the I, narc? I, I think I know who <laughs> it is. Who's the fucking pudwhacker? I mean, you guys aren't even going to know her name. Obviously not. Yeah. Like, and it, um, What else happened to band camp? Wait, oh, Caden, did you, you, did you go to band camp ever? No. Caden's oh. not been in band. <laughs> wow, yes. he's just been sitting here the whole time. I was in band in fifth grade, and I played the alto saxophone. Yeah. All right. Is that it? Yep. <laughs> I mean, I have more. <laughs> Why'd you quit stories, band? I guess. Because I was bad at saxophone. Nobody's good at anything in you fifth practice, grade, bro. I mean, I was worse than everybody else significantly. Why are you using the accent? <laughs> Don't worry so, about it. Is that just <laughs> Although my uh, hopefully I'm getting a guitar for Christmas, so I'm oh, gonna nice. teach myself how to do that. Dope. That's sick. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm going um, to Spain over the summer, so maybe I should learn some guitar. Mm. <laughs> or I'm Spanish. Working yeah. on Spanish guitar. <laughs> well, you're minoring in Spanish. Uh, majoring, in majoring Spanish. Majoring in Spanish? <laughs> yes. Okay. And political science. Yeah. Double Good major stuff. game. Let's go. Good stuff. Um, what else happened in band camp? Um, this didn't happen during band camp, but I thought about it anyway because it involved band kids. Because it always does. Um, they were actually show choir kids more than band kids because you know show choir is like a specific personality. Yep. Oh, what are you talking about? I yep. show choir. Yeah, but it's a specific personality. Uh, you don't. I don't think you're a show choir person. Well, maybe a little bit. Um, no, you're like, like a, one of the show choir people. That's like one of the but you're nice. quieter show. But, but, well, yeah, but like, show choir kids are always nice. They're just like typically more out there. Y- crackheads. Yeah. Straight up. Grace. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, no. I did like show choir and theater and stuff, and I was like, I did not fit in with that group, <laughs> group of people. I, would I tell fit you in that. so well with the theater kids. I, <laughs> yeah, I did. I did cast for a while for musicals, for like a year and a half. You, and then you I do seem like a crew. cast person. No, no crew person. Sorry. Yes, I'm a crew person. Yeah, no, yeah. I'm not a cast person. Mm. No, <laughs> this didn't the happen during band camp. This happened during school. Uh, <laughs> okay. Actually, not even during school. It was like. I don't know exactly when it happened. It was at some after school music, like one of the music department things. It was either a show choir or a choir event. Mm -hmm. One of the kids that I knew who was also in band got caught fingering his girlfriend. Jesus. On the stage in the atrium behind the curtain. Uh, by the ba- sh- assistant band director. So uh, if what we're a legend. If we're gonna go that, <laughs> if we're gonna go that route, there was a kid in my class. Um, it was weird and. Uh, just he was just one of those dudes who was just off, you know. Just nothing, nothing particularly Did he wrong come in about the hallway? him. No, huh. no, no, even worse. Um, so there was a, a worse. <laughs> well, yeah, honestly, there was a freshman girl. Um, he was a senior. No, 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 no. They no, were no, buddies, no, no, no. right? They were friends. Oh, do not. And, uh, no, no, no. He was in charge of uh, um, like the sound and lighting stuff in like the booth up there. This Making was like look bad. this was the night of the show. Oh no. Right, and he, uh. No, he's like, they they went they came early like way before anyone else. They came. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> they, and they went up to the light booth. This dude closed the door, locked it, turned off the lights, and said, "Do you want to take a, a nap with me?" And like, I guess grabbed her ass or something. And here's the worst part about it: this kid 
is was the superintendent's son. He just got a slap on the wrist. He didn't even he hardly got in any trouble for that shit. If if it was anybody else in that position, dude was like almost eighteen, like a couple like a week or two away. God damn. Wait, yeah. Mm, was she don't like that. Okay. Oh, she didn't like it at all. Okay. She, she yeah. lost her shit. Yeah. Okay. Understandable. The, the dude's creepy. I mean, the dude's really okay, fucking I weird. Okay. I, I thought you were implying that they were going to fuck up there. Like, no, no. But, I mean, he like, probably would have. I mean, oh, I thought you were implying. Okay, never mind. I thought, like, they were, like, a thing. Never mind. No, no. Nope. Not at all. Damn. There was a kid like that uh, in our in at my high school. He would come up, like, behind you. He prided himself. He had, like, anger issues, I think. Oh. Because. But the school never did anything about it, but it was bad enough that he would get repeatedly involved in fights, and the school wouldn't do anything about it because they couldn't, because his parents were like, he has anger issues. And they were like, okay. I, you gotta love that shit. But, <laughs> uh, yeah, they were kind of enablers, but I wasn't super close to the situation, so I don't know. But he had this thing where he would go up behind you in the hallway. He would he prided himself on his sneaking skills. He'd come up behind you and just grab you and be like, hey yo, did I scare ya? <laughs> What? <laughs> That's exactly how he said it. But we were talking yeah. about this last night. Yeah. No. So, moral of the story is like freshman sophomore year, I was super super skittish. Like if you startled me too much, I would just panic. So he came up behind me in the hallway when I was walking to one of my classes and like grabbed me and I dropped everything I was holding and yelled. Oh. And he stopped doing that to some people I knew. For example, uh, my now girlfriend, but not at the time. He grabbed her and she elbowed him directly in the <laughs> face, and he did not come near her since. Good uh, shit. I did also kind of do the same thing because he came up behind me and wrapped his arms around my waist from mm. behind, and I was oh like, boy. "All right, I don't like this. Please go away, my friend." And then he continued to do it, so I Should've had to him. fight him. Did you? I did not fight him. You I should've. just, I just pretended to react on a hair trigger and hit him. Wait, so you did hit him? Yes. Oh, okay. Did you stop? <laughs> I Yeah, just like pop the elbow back oh, okay. since he's behind you. Kendall, just know that if I knew you in high school, I would have punched, I would have beat him up for you. <laughs> Everyone wanted to, but he had like... Just imagine being that guy. You just like, I got anger issues, had, so I'm just going to like well, literally assault everybody and get did, away from it. <laughs> he, did have, he did have problems, but... That doesn't excuse it. Yeah, That's it doesn't thing. excuse the and behavior, especially when it happens over and over again. And it was deliberate in sad, a way that it would stop happening yeah. when... He either knew that you would fight back or – and he knew he could, like, kind of molest people and get that's, away with it. And I was like, mm, not fun. But, yeah, well, he was in band. Really really ending the episode on <laughs> – <laughs> oh, I mean, do we want to, like, try to end it on a nicer note? Um, I, we've got well, one let's talk about – um, uh, oh, well, I guess um, – so you guys like puppies? Yeah. 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 Puppies yeah. are cute. What kind of dog? Best. Um, what kind of dog? I mean, best? although my, my dog's a Llewellyn Setter, she but like you knew. A, gold, a Golden Lab's is always amazing. Newfoundlands. Oh, no, Britney's. Yeah. How about you? Um, you know, I've I've always had small dogs, but I'd love to have a German Shepherd. German Shepherd would be dope. Yeah. Yeah. Let's, um, and also this is the uh, I guess this 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 is the last episode of season one of the Fishbowl. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Woohoo. Yeah. Thanks for listening up till now. Yeah. Yay. Thank you. For, I hope you continue. Yeah. We're officially bingeable now. We're long enough that you can binge listen. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fun times. Yay. Mm-hmm. We got like half a day worth of. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. This is our 12th episode. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Heck yeah. Good shit. Woo. Yeah. I have like at least like 70 gigabytes <laughs> with like. Of audio? Uh, like just information for the show and shit. Dang. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, have a happy Fishbowl Friday. Oh, uh, yes. And you know, since everyone's been gone for a while, I guess you know, have a happy uh, holidays. Yeah, have yes. a happy holidays. Oh, yes. If uh, you don't hear from us again, have mm. a good Chrysler. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, Vern, thank you very much for coming on the show. Oh and, yeah, of course. No, I had so much fun. Yes. Uh, all right. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. 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 Peace.